Hi everyone, you might appreciate my view from another room I'm staying in, a dormitory at the Amigo Hostel in Amsterdam. If you, that's the tram, tramway. It's kind of expensive here, two euro seventy for a ride if you are not like on some kind of pass. And then over there, I think it's a Montessori school social housing of some sorts here and then way far ahead where you see those towers is where you have downtown and while beautiful I really don't like it that much there because it's literally a tourist trap in the worst way and not so pleasant to see all those people who've been trafficked and stuff. Mm, uh, sorry for the dirty window, but it's a little bit cold. Tonight it's just me and one other person in this room. Uh, in that general direction of downtown, about three blocks up, I was drawn to a shop front that had a bunch of spiritual books in the window. And it turns out that it's a pretty well-known sect that really peaked in the 80s. And I'll have to put details below because I've just woken up from a nap and I'm not too sure of the name of it. Or if I did attempt it, I would bungle it. And uh, I got kind of roped in for a while because I was looking for something to just kind of hear about. And it got mm, pretty well informed of this group based out of London. And it's making me wonder if they are related to this aunt and uncle that somebody I know in England said formed a, a pretty marginal sect and then used it as a tax haven and to enjoy three homes in Australia, the UK, and the south of France. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.